You know, many people have asked me, how does it feel to have this kind of job? And what is your goal? Well, let's set the record straight. You wake up, show up, and be great. Embrace making history. There's no time to fear success. You've got to have a selective ear, thick skin, and activate that inner beast mode. Reaching greatness requires lifestyle changes that most are not willing to give up. Certain things I've realized, I just can't do anymore. There's people that I've realized I can't bring with me on this journey, and there's certain habits that I've got to eliminate while other habits I've got to embrace. Embracing is huge. I mean, you gotta love working. No, I mean like really, really love it. Roster spots are limited out there, and the basketball politics are a real thing. Embrace the responsibility of representing the United States. It's a crazy honor. After all, each team usually allows only one to three Americans, if any at all. So embrace that pressure. The lights are bright, so you can't want success at high levels without pressure. You're being paid for your talent and your production, then using your abilities to be a blessing financially not only to yourself, but to your family and to the many others who are in need. It's a big responsibility. So you've got to bring it every night, whether you feel like it or not. And at the end of the day, your coaches, your teammates, the fans, the media, and the entire city is relying on you to make a difference. I'm very particular on reaching and surpassing my standards, so I work. I work in the off season, before practice, during practice, and after practice to make the games feel easier. So what is success and what is the goal? Get your facts straight before your outlandish assumptions because it's not about a specific league or even status. It's certainly not a self-confidence issue about not trying. Society knows what I've done. Most importantly, I know what I've done and who I've done it against. So I know that I can play anywhere. But for me, it's not about that at all. It's about my story and being in the best fit situations. Living in happiness, having a high influence, producing results, and making history. I'm not competing with what you say I should be doing and where I should be doing it to base that on my level of success. You see, God has blessed me because I understand that most athletes are not able to play this game at a high level professionally and even collegially. The numbers don't lie. So yeah, I realize that I've already beaten the odds and I'm still beating the odds to this day. That is growth. That is success. That is happiness. My name is Kyle Gupton. And this is my journey.